All right, now let's go across to somebody who's designed this car and the way it looks. Of course, it's important to know what was the inspiration behind it. I have with me Ms. Uh, Shohi Park, who's the head of uh, Hyundai Advanced Design Department. Thank you very much, uh, Ms. Park, for sparing time. Thank you. So, you know, this is obviously a very good looking car. First and foremost, I want to understand from you the cues that you've taken, the inspiration that you've taken to de design this one. I believe it's, it's related to chess in some ways, right? Yes. So the old design in Hyundai, are, we are running for the running under the, our sensuous sportiness, big design keyword. And while we are developing the Tucson, uh, the, our chief director's order was the let's make a most dynamic SUV ever. Most dynamic, dynamic SUV, SUV ever. ever. Okay. ever. So uh, we, our old designers are running for that. And then we define parametric dynamism a strategy under our sensual supportings. So we try to make uh, achieve uh, with this profile to make a most dynamic proportion and also the parametric yeah, jewel. Yeah, mm. that's the, it looks pretty nice. Yes, it okay, so you think you feel fulfill that uh, the command that was given about making it the most dynamic SUV? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> When it comes to interiors, and yes. that's something that is very important, uh, we've seen a very different design language. Yes. Uh, you know, you, usually Hyundai car has a very signature yes. style, but this is very minimalistic. Yes. Is this the cue, or, uh, or we can take cue from this to say this is how the future cars will look like, or at least the SUVs? Uh, as I mentioned, uh, in Hyundai design philosophy, yeah. each car we gave each uh, spirit because of the but once we develop this Tucson, uh, we make uh, some, our interior concept was the interspace. Mm -hmm. It means the humanized technology and then also the high-tech matters uh, inter intersect naturally. So that's why we discover this kind of very minimal flow mm -hmm. in the interior and downward AV and uh, cluster display and make it open air space. Mm -hmm. And then also the, as you see the interior, uh, you have to also focus. This is not a exterior. This is a space. Sp a lot yes. of space. Space, and yes. then also, so we focusing on the space, mm -hmm. and then experience. It's direct experience with the co our customer and driver and passenger as well. So we just uh, maximize our space, and. Um, focusing on the how we can create the most comfortable space for the customer. So as you mentioned, so that's why it's definitely different between inside and outside. Uh, Absolutely. Outside is most dynamic ever. Very, very dynamic. But inside is very, very soothing, simple and high tech and luxury. So uh, so you can I can just explain the someone, the king as an emperor with a very strong appearance and powerful, but inside, always generous. Generous. And, uh, All right, it's like a king <laughs> who looks very yes. dynamic from the outside yeah. and but, from the inside, very generous. Yes. Oh. What a beautiful way to explain yes. this. Thank you so much, Ms. Park. <laughs> it was lovely speaking with you. And we hope that this is the design language that will be carried forward for other SUVs, or you think it's very specific to Tucson only? Uh, I can't mention about <laughs> the future, but anyway, uh, you can only memorize the each car we gave the each car we gave the their own character sure. in under our big umbrella as the sensuous sportiness. So we our designers just to try to figuring out the best solution for the each car. For each car. But so the this parametric dynamism can be translated uh, with the best way to nice. each okay. car lineup. So. All, right. <laughs> so. All right, thank you so thank much. Thank you so Lovely much. Lovely meeting you. Uh, Congratulations. Lovely to see you. Thank time. you. Uh, Cheers. Thank you. Okay.